I always uh, explain to my friend in Europe that uh, why Japanese fashion is interesting because we have no class system. Especially in Japan, we, we might be ahead of the other country. People wearing more genderless style. Originally, kimono, the Japanese culture, kimono is genderless, only one design. But the way, the way we wearing kimono, we can be masculine or feminine. I, I really feel that we have this uh, generous concept for the clothing in our DNA. I always try to be simple, but uh, even with the most simple style, I want to put some elegance on it. wider pants. Our customer also start wearing the wider chinos. So white chinos need uh, the good fabric, good draping, and interesting finish. I can wear chino with any kind of uh, clothing, except funeral. I started my uh, career in a fashion company in uh, 1977 and actually the clothes was uh, the, a kind of a, our competitor in that time. But uh, we are very uh, impressed by the trousers. Clothes has a very original design in the late 70s and early 80s and still going on. If I think about the, the company clothes, quickly I imagine Ah, let's make the, the trousers together. Maybe my major interest is going to music. So if I don't do fashion, I do something with music. The biggest turning point for my style is David Bowie and Brian Ferry. David Bowie for uh, originality, and Brian Ferry is for even wearing classic style, you can be avant-garde. We can wear clothing for ourselves, not as the tool of uh, seduction. We can use our imagination, we can use our freedom to wear more interesting ways.